labor became a very big problem after everything resumed. Labor availability, it was hard. It was really hard because the number of positions during COVID shrunk. We lost freelancers, everything went back to normal, and now those positions came back and we don't have anybody to fill the roles. Mm -hmm. So that really helped sell the idea that, oh, this person can do a game in California from an office in New York, and there's nothing wrong with that. Mm -hmm. So that really helped sell that idea. And it has helped open up technicians to wherever they're living, they can work on these events. And it's really not, it's not that much of a hurdle anymore. I love how much yeah. that has also opened the opportunities for women like me in production technology that before we would have had to travel. Not that we don't nowadays, we still do. But prior to that, like taking a week, two, three weeks out of the month to be gone on shows, that has a huge impact on a family, on your spouse, on your kids, and especially if you have a family, right? And mm -hmm. now that there's options where, you know, you can do a production role remotely it gives women like me you know that's why i'm so like <laughs> strong on creating opportunities that are available to women in av productions and live streaming and broadcasting how that has opened so many more possibilities and as much as you know we talk about covid was a bad thing i love to look at the silver lining like every time there's something bad there's always a silver lining and i feel like a lot of what we're just talking about is that silver lining you know new possibilities new opportunities opportunities and new ways to do things that before we have not considered. And to me, that's a win. Absolutely. And it allowed me to, the combination of that and then the tools that were available in the cloud, it allowed people to have, use equipment or provide equipment that you didn't have to go out and all of a sudden buy. You can just spin some resources up in the cloud on demand. Your bandwidth at home doesn't matter anymore. As long as it's enough to control whatever you're controlling, you've got a very flexible system that you can now start providing technical services for events and doing it from home. You get that balance. And that was the big thing that a lot of the, a lot of the technical directors that work with me with some of my live streaming clients, that was the biggest thing they said is it's so nice to be at home for a couple of days a week instead of constantly having to go on the road or constantly having to drive mm -hmm. to a location. You just get that mental break and do what you love to do and feel like you have a, a normal schedule for, for a little while at least.